I'm not sure how you will feel when you get unlimited access to something but without paying for it and it's something which you needed the most. Imagine Netflix. You have tons of content there and will never finish. Now the situation is the one who is paying for it have no control or access to his her own account. Something similar happened to me. I made this video just to highlight what may go wrong and the precautionary measures one must take. My Netflix account was compromised as you can see. I was sent a notification email while I was asleep that suspicious activity reported against my account. I saw that email while I was on the way to office. They sent me a password reset link to but when I tried that link didn't work. There was another email that someone has changed my email ID. I mean fantastic. What kind of security privacy you guys have? The email which is now there in my account as you can see in the screenshot is not a valid email ID even if you try to do that so you will find this email is not a valid. Instead of blocking the access so only the authorized person can act or log into the account they, they did let someone else to gain the control i tried to contact netflix installed an application on my phone netflix application as suggested on their site to get the instant help but nothing literally worked for me i tried i, I found nothing useful site is so fucked up and really you see the helpful content there i tried to find the direct number again nothing worked i rushed home because i knew from where i can get into my account it's my laptop because i'm still logged in there the person who logged into my account he forgot he or she forgot to sign out from all the other devices so that's the reason i was still logged in now since i'm home i clicked on my account change email id and there i need to enter current password i don't have a current password but there is an option called as forgot password as you know all the sites have this forgot password netflix is so secure that forgot password will give you the option to enter mobile number any mobile number you get the code i enter the mobile number i got the code because the guy also changed my mobile number and they changed it to email id everything so now this is a security they provide really this is 21st century someone else can put their own credential and they can get my own details whatever they want to do they can do in my account okay thank god netflix is not running a bank else we were bankrupt i asked for a refund they refused but they did agree that security breach has happened on my account they can see that only one person is logging in all the time which is me my laptop all the details they have there i suggested them i told them this is the breach you have there on the, your side anybody can put their mobile number and get all the details and get it into my account so this is very easy for hackers to come in and do whatever they want to do this is not supposed to be there they said okay sir thank you very much for your valuable feedback we have taken this blah 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 but i'm not getting the refund this is it this is what you need to think about when you think about netflix and this is what the precautionary measure the one might take or one should take for me the best is create dummy account create use it let it be as it is i know while creating a temporary account as well you need to put the bank account details there but even for one month you don't pay it before one month the moment you notice it close it you don't pay for it because they are they are not secure they don't provide you security they don't guarantee that your information will be secure with them this is what my worst experience is i don't want it to happen with you guys so please share it with your loved ones share with the one that you really care about so they know what may go wrong and what precautionary measure or how they are supposed to act on such kind of situation thanks for watching guys thank you very much